Welcome to today's Bible study where we continue in 1 John. Before we start, let's go to the Lord in prayer. Our Father in heaven, thank you for who you are. Thank you for your creation and all the wonders around us. As we hear your word today, help us retain and live your word in Jesus' name. Amen. 1 John 2, 1. My dear children, I write this to you so that you will not sin. But if anyone does sin, we have an advocate with the Father, Jesus Christ, the Righteous One. Interesting points. First, in this verse, John provides a message of reassurance for Christians who sin even as they strive for spiritual maturity. He notes that we have hope in times of sin through Jesus Christ, who serves as our advocate with the Father. Second, here, John refers to Jesus as the Righteous One. The Greek word translated advocate is parakleton, which is also used in John 14, 16, and 26, 15, 26, and 16, 7 as a reference to the Holy Spirit. This word literally means the one who pleads a case on someone else's behalf or a close, helpful advisor. Third, John heavily emphasizes the greatness of Jesus and his role as advocate on our behalf before the Father. Other New Testament passages, such as Romans 8.34 and Hebrews 7.25, also describe Jesus and the role of an advocate for believers. Application. This verse reminds us that Jesus will speak to our Heavenly Father in our defense when we sin. There is no better advocate than our Lord and Savior who not only knows the law completely, he has an intimate relationship with the judge and has already covered us by assuming our full debt and punishment at Calvary. Rather than becoming preoccupied and losing momentum in our faith because we are fixated about sins which we have already held up to the Lord and repented of, we can draw our strength in knowing that our Lord fully expects us to stumble as we mature spiritually. And as we grow in discipline and obedience, we will find that our character, discernment, and behavior become more resilient in the face of temptation, sin, and knowledge that we can submit to and rely fully on our advocate to grow and strengthen us. That's our Bible study for today. Just a reminder that uh, the people that write these uh, commentaries and the voices that you hear are all volunteers, and we do it just for the love of Christ and want to help get the word out any way possible. If you appreciate that, please reach down and hit the like button and subscribe. That really helps get it out to other people. Thank you.